I guess I am gonna be a bit tight in time, tight in time. So I do my best. Forgive me if I go faster than I would love to. Yes, I'm a librarian. I have warned you, I'm a librarian, 100%. I work at the technical processes department of the cataloging processes department of the library. I'm in the library side of this project, datos.bne. I don't have time to present the project as such, uh, but I'm going to focus on how the workflows go between library data and linked data. I can feel, we all can feel that there is a widening gap between library produced by traditional uh, library information management tools and other data produced in linked data friendly tools. So what I want, uh, I'm going to try to to explain is how these two worlds are interacting together. Our our data stuff we need. Okay, that is what we need. Um, I invite you to look in your computer or so to try to make some um, searches, or you can listen to me. You can make, you can believe me. It is in Spanish. Sorry, at this time it is now a fully functioning link database gateway access catalog, whatever you call it, into the library resources. Um, for library resources, I mean you can use datas.bini for using uh, traditional library resources. We are include only access to physical items possessed by the library. This is how the philosophy of traditional catalog works. But using our linked data approach have allowed us to give uh, leverage or uh, preeminence to other areas of the of work at the library. I mean. Uh, you can search now data about authors. You users can perform search about authors by genre or place of birth or profession or whatever. Uh, we can also liberate our vocabularies, performing a sort of achieving some multilingualism uh, through subject, also about items. And I call it fully functioning because right now it is uh, uh, it can uh, play it can act as a standalone catalog uh, to the library because it is linked to other daily routines of the library such as the digital library items, loan services, or uh, reproduction orders or document delivery service. And it has also improved dramatically the disposal of library data in the web. Uh, giving access to the library from straight from search engine results and really getting close the user to the to the to the library. Okay, uh, 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 the datos.pini is F FRBR based, and I mean FRBR, not LRM, because it was uh, designed what FRBR was the word, not LRM. It's not fully LRM. Uh, I mean, this is uh, FRBR, as you, many of you will probably know, is the conceptual model for representing bibliographic information, as my colleague from Netherlands has said. Uh, and meaning that data is grouped and sorted in entities representing core concepts uh, of library wall. And it's, it's the foundation for the search and retrieval processes of, of datos.bni. These entities are also interlinked, linked to other sources, and uh, enriched with outside data, as we will see right now. Um, this is the uh, underlying basic data model. It's loosely based on, um, of the, it has the main core entities of FRBR. Uh, you see person on corporates who are linked to works, who are linked to resources, who are linked to items, and you see up there subjects who are linked to all of them. Here we go. It's not strict FRBR. Of there are some loops or shortcuts to make the entities work better together. Um, and uh, one of the key features of, um, and uh, I want to explain, is the the, all these entities and all, all these relationships come from the old school Mark 21 records. We, we, all of us, many of us know 
So as a way, I love this example. The, we are jumping from a flat bidimensional 2D structure uh, of Martin T1 records into a full 3D, uh, <laughs> full of entities records. OK, what's happening be behind the scenes? I'm not a, a technician at all, but I can see, uh, tell you a couple of words of this. Uh, let's take a glimpse in the magic between. Uh, the main step is the data generation, and this the source of the the mark data from the catalog, <coughs> and it's done by a by a by a tool with uh, an in-house built tool called Marimba. Marimba is a exotic musical instrument, and it is the piece of software that deal with mark structure is specially tailored with work with market structures and records, and which performs all of these tasks, the data analysis, the mapping, the sorting, the link data generation, and also then linking and enrichment. Yes, and for the publication, I mean, for constructing the, the front end, you will see in .s.pne, there is also uh, a pipeline or, or of software, of structure, the indexing, who is rank uh, rank based in, in FRBA relationship, the more relationship, the highest the rank. And also it has stored doubly, uh, uh, two fold, uh, one for the front end and one for the triple store, using, as you see, this uh, open source tools. Maybe you know more about them than me. Uh, let's take a brief look into uh, Marimba. Marimba is a uh, is a piece of software design which is the core of datos.bne. It is it's a software written by the uh, ontology engineering group, who is a cutting edge for the Polytechnic University in Madrid. And and keeping for all these all these tags is the, the ingestion and analysis of Mark 21 records, and also great uh, uh, do a great work of error reporting. There is uh, it performs three maps with Mark 21, one based on the uh, on the in the records. I give you an example: an authority record with a given tag and a given subfield combination of fields and subfield is deemed at C115, who is uh, a person in ontology. The second one is a model entity linking, and it also based, this is the object properties that go from one uh, entity to another. We are based on, and on mark fields also, and internal kills are also inferred by some processes I don't have time to go into. And there is the data properties that goes from subfields. For instance, this means place of publication. If you talk mark, you will see clearly. And finally, it deals with RDF generation. OK, so the main data flows is this the 90% of the uh, of the all of the data.bne content comes from straight from Mark 21 fields. There are also maybe more than 90%, uh, I think. There also comes in uh, data coming from our digital library. And there is a third part with other sources I'm going to tell you a couple of things about. OK, this is uh, a snapshot from the from one of web page from the datos.bne. It's of the, the same as links with other vocabularies or other libraries uh, are taken from the identifiers from BF, from the data dump from, from, from BF. We can use them to construct these same as links. Uh, you can see here links from any author, from Goethe, to, uh, of course, we're in Germany, from Goethe, uh, to National Library of France, to National Library of uh, Germany, to Sudoc, for instance, or Library of Congress. And there is also this, uh, this is a snapshot for the web page for Goethe, the authority record, if you want, from Goethe, this displays image taken from uh, DBpedia for two properties from DBpedia, abstract and thumbnail. And this is the only piece of data that are kept up in datos.bne and not back in the catalog.
Okay, we have performed some enrichment and data imports just to make the data more complex. The main enrichment, of course, is the everyday job. This is something I kept repeating to all the people at the library. Uh, catalogers are instructed to create uh, metadata or records that make the linking easier for datas.bne. Our RDA profile is um, aim to that, to create data with works and expressions and so on, that makes the linking easier. That's the, but we have also <coughs> make some experiments with, oh, with selecting sources and performing some data mining or data crunching and goes to the library system and then those goes to datas.bne. Sources we have been experimenting with uh, libraries, but also from beyond. We have imported identifiers, identifiers. We have imported equivalences. We have imported pieces of data from many. There are, for instance, Library of Congress. There is also a um, National Institute of Statistics, National Geographic Institute, or DLNet, um, uh, who is a journal's bibliographic database. We have imported data from all of this, and of course, our, our data, our legacy data, with some data crunching, is best suited for enrichment and for data that does not be need to make profit of it. Okay, but this year we have taken the other way around. We have uh, we wanted to 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 do some kind of project with Wikidata, with data with free Wikidata, with see what we could do with this. Because we have uh, datos.bne allow us to conduct searches on authors and so on, but we, we lack the data. So we have tried out our, our achievement, our, our output, main output has seen done uh, more than 80,000 personal authority records has been enriched with data from Wikidata. Uh, the main uh, the, the pipeline or has, has been this. Uh, we have extracted from BF cluster data dumps, uh, BNE IDs, and, and we are publicly available the data dumps from BF web page, BNE IDs and Wikidata IDs to extract uh, equivalences from this. Okay, then we have. Select properties when wicked from Wikidata who might be of interest for us uh, using the Wikidata IP using the IDs. Uh, we have to retrieve these selected properties from every ID in JSON, then was performed some sorting and grouping, and then we have taken the step back from Wikidata converted to Mark 21 records and then up again to datas.bne, as you will see now. Uh, this, is, this has been done by the current technology and partner of datas.bne, this is a company called Memorandum. After that, after all with, the, all with data, we are librarians, we don't trust anyone, so we want some quality checkups. Some of my colleagues really are really frightened with data coming from Wikidata, I must say. So we performed some general quality checkups. For instance, one of the one of the properties we uh, love more was this P737 from Wikidata, which influenced by. But analyzing the data, we saw that uh, we couldn't trust it because it was quite wrong and subjective, not suitable for a national library. So it's what I told this disregarded. And then we work on some other properties, uh, mainly occupation, which is a very interesting property to look to look for users to research. Uh, so we we have done some quality checkup before. Uh, first sorting, grouping and arranged them for revision by experts. And then in every value we decided if, if whether to keep it, align it with our BNE subject vocabulary, or disregard it. As we see, we have work in a Excel spreadsheet. I'm sorry, the Spanish, we can see. Do I have a pointer? Okay. These are values from Wikidata. 
and this is the decision we have taken. Some of them are aligned mainly in plural with our, our subject vocabulary uh, accessory. Uh, some of them as disregarded, but are mean erase, delete, delete. And um, some of them goes blank, that means that code is straight into the field. So quite easy for librarians to, oh, five minutes, okay. Let's go to the best part. Uh, I'm going to walk you through what happened to one piece of data in uh, Wikidata to up to down to the catalog and then up again to the datas.pne. I must warn you, this data is not yet up in the production, so you cannot perform search on that. On that, I expect it will be the next year. Oh, sorry, the next month available. So you must trust me now. Okay, this is a Wikipedia. Yeah, a bit down. This is a Wikipedia a page for ICT. ICT seems to be a famous rapper. I'm not an expert in this, but it's American rapper. Um, you probably know the Wikidata version of this, of this, of every uh, Wikipedia page. So let's see what's in and the occupation from uh, ICT say this he's a rapper. Okay. If you go to the rapper web page, this is the Wikidata, this is the the page for rapper for the concept rapper in Wikidata. We see here the Spanish label who is of interest of us. Okay. So it goes again to the quality checkup. My colleagues said that rapero, which is rapper in Spanish, or equivalent term in a subject vocabulary is raperos in plural. Okay, so we choose this, and then it goes to the old-fashioned Mark 21 field. It is the, the authority, the work uh, record for ICT, and this is this mean professions, and here is Raperos. As you see, all this data is marked as coming from Wikidata here. Okay. Okay, then go up to datos.bne. This is the uh, datos.bne front end for front end for advanced uh, search on authors. You can retrieve authors from place of birth, the place of death. Uh, title and other characteristics, area of expertise, institutions, uh, uh, year of birth, year of death, so on. And there is the profession, occupation. So we type here, Raperos, and hop, he will pop up as our dear ICT. So this is the way. Well, there, there are a couple of concerns for finishing. Uh, provenance is, um, we are a national library, we can, it is of utmost importance that if any data is not coming for us, uh, so it is very clear that it's not for us. At this moment, it is, as you see, is in the library state of the data, not is in the RDF net yet. It's not easy to do, it seems easy, but it is not because Marimba works with subfields. So there is no way at this moment to tell Marimba that this subfield co goes or corresponds with this value because they are discrete pieces of data. So it seems easy, but it's not. Okay. And finally, the quality thing. The quality thing is of the most concern of most of my colleagues. Uh, we have found some serious incidences because we have inherited PF uh, mappings. So some mappings might be wrong. Okay, one minute. I'm I'm just finishing. So it is a minor incident, but it is a serious one. We have found there there are many funny people in the Wikidata world. So we have inherited very bad data. This is. Uh, Jovellanos, this is a, a political figure, um, philosopher from 19th century Spain. So what happened with the profession? You see, you, do you understand Spanish? <laughs> you say this is actor, YouTuber, video gamer, this is a janitor. 
what happens here was something that's funny enough to go to Tobeyana's Wikidata and put funny things. So uh, we have find we and uh, we of course we cannot go record by record uh, uh, checking the data. So this is a risk we are taking. My final advice and keep calm and don't be afraid of errors. I keep this one on one telling to my colleagues because they are very concerned about this. Um, I think that's uh, all. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ricardo. And now we have time for one or two questions. So bring them on. Everyone wants lunch? Uh, well, I will ask a quick question. Maybe there will be another one. Uh, so uh, are you aware uh, of uh, who is using your data and how? How is this uh, information being used? Good question. Um, well, our main users we have found at datus.bne is um, a functioning web. Our, our main user has been the everyday citizen because they of their researcher we can perform expert searches on datos.bne um, but mainly people uh, typing in google in their homes some uh, spooky thing about music from 70s or whatever and finding that the resources eat in a library i mean is the user is not going to the library to see if we have something but the user is looking for something up in Google and goes to the library. That's one thing. As for expert users on the Sparkle and, and all of these things, we have been talking with some uh, researchers. We have been grappling with the data but it tends to be that a data model by FRBR and so on are too complex for them. This is one of the I fear of that question <laughs> because, yes, it's it's quite complex to to play with data model by a Fourier or RM for them to understand and to play with. All right, thank you. Um, more questions? Over there. How is the linking between uh, YAF and Wikidata made? So I see it, there's not, it's not complete because there are maybe some black holes in YAF and Wikidata. So who, who makes those links between? And how with people with similar names, for example? Uh, well, the, the links from BNE &E to Wikidata, you mean? Who makes these links? Or? Yeah, yes, how, how is the linking done? Is it automatically? No, this is not automatically. This is this has been done by um, by SOR in in BF by BF experts. This is where we have taken the the mappings. We have in we have uh, downloaded the BF cluster. Uh, BF has relationship with many relationships with Wikidata. We have used their equivalences. So we are our data, our records are in BF. Our IDs ears are in BF. The Wikidata IDs are in BF. So all we had to do was to download the the the, the data, the BF, uh, the the IDs, the clusters IDs, and clean the all the IDs that are not uh, BNE and and Wikidata, and yes, use them. So there are many. Of course, there are many Spanish author who is not. Uh, who hasn't got a, a Wikidata a Wikidata page, or who is not in BF? So they are lost links. Okay, and from now from now from now on from then on, uh, authority experts are told to look up the Wikidata Wikipedia and paste the paste the the Wikipedia ID. So we are using them, but but the fine but the initial the initial upload we use the the BF information. I don't know if I answer your question. <laughs> if not at lunch we can talk further. All right. Uh, thanks again.